Hello, my name is Soundrip. Welcome to the third How to Produce Ambient Music. Today it's going to be fairly short. We're just going to be talking about harmony additions. Um, and what this basically means is this is a type of harmony that isn't necessarily the main harmony of the song, but it's used to complement the original harmony, usually a chord progression, um, to give that to give it an extra an extra layer uh, to make it feel like it's a lot bigger. Um, than the original harmony section. So normally for this in ambient music we use a synth pad. Um, we've already used a synth pad so I've used another synth pad um, and generally these sections are higher in pitch uh, than the original harmony section. Um, so I'll show you how I've done that when we get into the mixcraft section of the video and afterwards I'll show you how to play the specific section if you want to follow along and make your first ambient song with me. So, uh, let's waste no time and let's jump straight into the Mixcraft section of the video to show what we're doing today. Okay, so for sound selection, we will be using the Dream Pad in Mixcraft. So that is located right in the Synth Pad Soft section. And it is found right here. So we'll select that. I've already got that selected, but we'll select Dream Pad again. There we go. And I'm now going to show you how to create this pattern on the piano. For starters, once again, we're in the F scale, so C is here, F is here, the scale is F, A, G, B flat, C, D, E, F. And the first thing we're going to do is for two measures is an F perfect fifth, which sounds like this. So it will sound like this when you record it. So it will be one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I apologize, the pitch bend isn't doing too well here. The pitch bend is a bit broken. So it won't sound like that when you do it. But right now I'm needing to fix that, I apologize. So once again, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We then go for one measure chords now, or one measure harmonies, sorry, we transition from a perfect fifth to a perfect fourth. So that's an F and a B flat together. One, two, three, four. I'll do that again. I'll try and get my finger out of the way. One, two, three, four. Now we're going to do what's called an octave. So that's just playing two of the same note together, just an octave apart. So it will be an F and an F. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So it's as simple as that and it'll sound something like this. So that's it for today's How to Produce Ambient Music. I hope that you've enjoyed this one, um, and I apologise that this one took a longer time than usual. Um, real life stuff, effectively, I was in between jobs um, and basically life being chaotic um, at my at my own fault, you know. But yeah, uh, that's that's been that one. Uh, next time we're going on to percussion, uh, and afterwards we're doing arrangement, uh, and then we'll be done. Uh, so I hope that you've enjoyed this one and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.